All right, we're taking a look at this 10 foot trailer wire, wiring harness. Came in this bag. There were three zip ties with it, and you get a reminder. Just a simple, simple explanation of uh, the standard four pin trailer wiring scenario, but it is very nice and descriptive if you're not doing those all the time. Here's the harness, wiring harness itself. Uh, somebody else, I think, had made a comment about the cable being stiff. I actually stuck this in the freezer uh, overnight, and, and it's warmed up since then. This is back to room temperature. At room temperature, it's pretty pliable. Um, I will confirm that it gets stiffer uh, when it's left in a freezer overnight, but not so stiff that I'm concerned about the jacket cracking or that there's going to be any issues with it. Um, it's a PVC jacket and it seems very tough. Uh, just one of those things with PVC is uh, they tend to be a, a little a little stiff, but uh, it's really not bad. Uh, 10 feet isn't going to get to the very back of most people's trailers, but it might get you back to a split or a Y where you uh, then go off to lights on either side or something like that. It'll work for me in my scenario. This plug on the end looks very heavy duty it's very thick got some uh, grip surface on it that will help when you're dealing with this with gloves and then just taking a quick look i already scored this with a knife so that i could get that insulation off there you can see that it has quite a thick uh coating the pvc that is protecting these wires, so I think this is going to last uh, much longer than a set of exposed wires. If I'm using this on my utility trailer, and these 18 gauge wires look pretty good, I don't know if I can get these all in one shot. Probably being over ambitious here, but we'll see. All but one. That's all right, we don't really need. Oh, I'll just nip that one since I did the others. All right, so inside of there, of course, we have our color-coded wires as per the wiring diagram provided, the match normal trailer wiring scenarios. And you can see you have nice 18 gauge stranded copper wire in here. Looks pretty good. Fairly fine strands, but nothing too flimsy. Uh, pretty decent quality. So that um, that will definitely work for me and uh, my trailer. So I'm gonna say I would recommend this.